your questions to us begin with vision as a context. And so our answer back also begins with vision as a context. Vision is where a community projects what it wants to be. Now, it might be that at the time, but it is always a projection of what it wants to be. This community is actually the envy of other communities because it has an authentic history and it has a legacy vision. Across Florida and across the country, communities make up history, they make up legacy because it's so important to people and it's so much a part of why somebody comes to a place. And so you have an advantage. You have an, an important asset in that, but you also have something that is maybe more importantly a tool. This community also began with a notion that it would be different from other communities. And you think about that. It was founded on a notion that Charles Frazier had that as he went along the coast that he was doing something different than the way other places were made. And that's an important part of the legacy to remember. But that legacy isn't just defined by the founders colorful as they are, and they are very colorful founders. Uh, they are, it is also defined by you as you go along. It's been defined by your association. In the vision for the association, it calls for a superior resort and residential community consistent with its founding values. I thought it was interesting that the assumption was everyone knew those values so clearly that they didn't have to be referenced consistent with its founding values, a, a sort of note of caution, make sure everyone knows what those are. But how it goes on, where stakeholders work cooperatively to achieve a, that common purpose. That's an incredibly important part of your legacy. That's the community part of your legacy. Finally, and maybe the most difficult to maintain over time, is the vision of community. It feeds back into value. It feeds back into all of the other pieces. But because it has to be maintained by storytelling, it is the part that is constantly in your hands. And if the story isn't told all the time and isn't told correctly, you lose track of this part. It is the part that gets interrupted. And it has to be told in a context of civil and productive discourse. What you were referencing in your underlying values is still there and still so much an important part of that vision. The shared places, the way you volunteer, both within and without. This is actually unusual. I don't see many communities that are as wonderful as that in the way they do this. But then keeping in mind that projection forward of becoming and staying a place of where the spirit of caring allows people to both age in place and attracts the new buyer because they want to be in a place like this. These are all the parts of the vision that you are moving forward. And again, you are making these both more explicit, you are preserving them, and you are rem remembering that this is your most vital asset. This is the, one of those things that makes you that different community imagined from the beginning, and it constitutes the tool going forward.